Welcome back, guys. We are here for another installment of online Timoyama kickboxing. Today's focus is going to be kicks. What to do with them? We always end with them, but there's other things we can do with them too as well, and we will find out that soon enough. Today we'll be joined by Miss Brittany Cloudy and Mr. Yuma Horiguchi. Hello, everybody. It is me, Yuma. Let's go ahead and get started. Yesterday was a lot of technique. We went a little easy on the death and torture. Today we'll pick it up a little bit. So no big deal. <laughs> they are very excited about it. With that in mind, move around, start shadow boxing, guys, and try to implement the kick. Any type of kicks you want. Um, implement it, and then we'll start adding some technique. Here we go. Yep. Go ahead and shadow box, guys, and implement the kick. Implement some kicks, however you want. Low kicks, body kicks, right leg, left leg, or any variation of kicks you guys like. If you guys have music you want to play in the background, please feel free to do so, but we will go music-free today so that you can hear the audio much more clearly. I don't know if it's by coincidence, but Yuma's always facing away from the camera. Maybe he's shy. But not Brittany. Brittany ain't shy. Give it about 30 more seconds. Time. Go ahead and squat, touch the ground, jump, touch the ceiling. Squat, touch the ground, jump, touch the ceiling. Squat, touch the ground, jump, touch the ceiling, and then add a sprawl. Back to the shadow box. Implement those kicks, guys. Implement those kicks. We got three rounds to warm up. We'll stretch it out and then we shall get started. Thirty more seconds. Ten seconds. Time, back on the ground, same motion, touch the ground, jump, touch the ceiling, hit a sprawl. We're gonna keep adding to it. Cool, go ahead and add four high knees. Touch the ground, jump, touch the ceiling, hit a sprawl, four high knees. Non-stop, non-stop. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 
time. Last round. Move around. Start shadow boxing. Implement those kicks. Final time. Final round for this warm up. Implement those kicks however you like. You can do exactly what they're doing, or you can do something at your own discretion, however you like. But we're just warming up, getting everything moving before we dive deeper into the technical portion of class. Twenty seconds. And time back to that routine we were doing. Touch the ground, touch the ceiling, hit a sprawl, four high knees. After the four high knees, fire one jump knee. Just like that. Ten seconds. And time. Let's go ahead and stretch it out, guys. Legs nice and straight, reach for the toes. Hit the squat, push the knees out with your elbows. Ooh, that sounded lovely. Walk your hands down, stretch your right calf. Switch. On your feet, grab your right leg. Balance on one foot. And switch. Right arm across the chest. Switch. Right arm behind the head. Switch. And freestyle. Stretch whatever you need.
and time. Here we go, guys. Klus has now officially begun. The focus today are utilizing those kicks. So we always end with a kick, right? Very, very common thing. Anytime most people implement kicks into their striking game, it's usually at the end. So it's hit, 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 end of the kick. Well, we're going to do just that. And then we're going to change it up just a little bit. And so go ahead and move around, guys, and set up a low kick. Set up a body kick, however you want. Set up a side kick. Any type of kicks you want, set it up. But you have to make the set up believable, right? So if you just pitter patter, they're they're not gonna see they're not gonna care to react to anything. So you've got to make the setup threatening. So fire two or three shots and then finish with some sort of heavy kick. So everything's hard, fast, live, live pace. Here we go. Hit it. Set up the kick. Set up the kick. Set up any kick. Standard, right? Very standard strategy when setting up kicks. You hit a few, distract them and then you finish with the kick. fire punches, elbows, knees, kicks. Shoot, you can set up a kick with a kick if you wish. But fire a few strikes and finish with a kick. Aim for the leg, aim for the body, aim for the head if you want. For warning, if you haven't fully warmed up and you try a head kick and you're not that flexible, you might fall. And that's okay. You can get back up and do it again. All kinds of ways, guys. You can keep firing the same setup, or you can change the setup every single time, or everything in between. Completely up to you guys. Let's set up that body kick. Here we go, facing towards the camera. Quick feet, go, go, go. Quick feet, quick feet, quick feet. Every time I say sprawl, hit the sprawl, get right back to the quick feet. Sprawl. 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 Spaghetti. Oh, they're good. This only works on the kids. All right, time. Back to the workout. <laughs> so we always end with kicks. Very, very common. But there's other ways you can do it too. And so let's do the reverse. Instead of setting up to end with the kick, why don't you start your combo with the kick? So whatever attack it is you're going to throw, Use the kick first, right? Let's go against the grain. Use your kick first before you set up whatever attack. So you can start with low kick, body kick, head kick, whatever you want. But start your combo off with a kick. So let's start with it. Go, hit it. Full pace. Doosh. And bang, bang, bang. Yep. Whether you stay square to your target or you reset and you spin around completely or you turn back, it's completely up to you. But start your attack off with the kick. You don't always have to end with the kick. You see Brittany here with assortment of kicks, not just your standard roundhouses and leg kicks and head kicks. She's got those side kicks too as well that you can throw. You can be as simple or as fancy as you like. Would not want to eat one of those. Time back to the quick feet. When I say sprawl, give me a sprawl. When I say a number, give me that number in push ups. Sprawl. Two. Sprawl. Four. Back to your feet, quick feet, quick feet. Sprawl. Six. Five. 
Right back to it, right back to it. Sprawl. Eight. If they're breathing heavy, you guys should definitely breathing, be breathing heavy as well. And that's a good sign. That means we're alive. Sprawl. Eight. Sprawl, 10. Beautiful. So the next thing we're going to work now too, and so initially we start time, time, time. Look at that. Brittany with the extra credit. If you guys want extra credit, always welcome to get it in. We ended our attack with a kick. We started an attack with a kick. And guess what? There's another option we can add in, which is implementing the kick in the midst of our attack and our combo. So the first one, we ended with a kick. The second one, we started with a kick. Now, I want you guys to implement the kick within your combo. So strike, have a kick within somewhere, and then finish with some more strikes. Let's see it live, guys. Go, go, go. Implement the kick within your attack. Bang, 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 beautiful. You guys can low kick, body kick, head kick, any type of kick you want, up kicks, axe kicks. Anything with the word kick in it, feel free to use it. But implement it in the midst of your combo or your attack. Thirty seconds. Five seconds. Time facing towards me. Quick feet, quick feet, let's see it. Every time I say sprawl, let me see a sprawl. Every time I say push up, give me one push up. Every time I say knee tuck, give me one knee tuck. Here we go. Sprawl. Knee tuck. Push up. Push up. Push up. Sprawl. Knee tuck. Sprawl. Knee tuck. Sprawl. Push up. S sprawl. Ooh, look at that. They knew I was going to say sprawl. Knee tuck. <clears throat> sprawl. Push up. Knee tuck. Push up. Get those knees up, Yuma. Everybody is watching. Sprawl. Knee tuck. Sprawl. Push up. Time. Let's put it all together now, guys. And so utilize any one of those three attacks. You guys can set up your attack and finish with the kick. You can start your attack with the kick, or you guys can implement the kick within your attack. And so let's see the three different ways to utilize those kicks within your attack. Here we go, live. Final round for this part.
30 seconds. Look at all the different ways that they're utilizing those kicks. Some of them they're ending with, some of them they're beginning with, and some of them they have in the midst of their combo. Awesome ways to implement kicks into your game. Time. Hit the ground, burnout push-ups for 10 seconds, as many as you can. Big push-ups, mini push-ups, doesn't matter. Any variant push-ups that you want for 10 seconds, the key is to just burn it out. Do as many as you can, however you want to do it. Ready, set, go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one time. If you guys need to grab a sip of water, please grab a sip of water. And in 60 seconds, we shall return. Do you need water, Yuma? Yes. Yes, he does. I suggest you guys get water too as well. While you guys are getting water, hope everything is going well. We're wishing you guys the best during this crazy, crazy time. Uh, we've been doing these online training sessions for about a week now. Uh, we think we got it pretty dialed in. We got the system right, we got the right platform. Um, we got a ton of great feedback. Um, we are live um, now with this. We'll be running classes every day, um, Monday through Saturday, from Cardi Kickboxing to Muay Thai and functional fitness with some special guests from our uh, UFC fighters and whatnot. So it's going to be really, really cool. If you guys would like to support the gym, um, there's a link in the post or in the bio in here if you guys want to click on it. Um, it's 50 bucks uh, for a month. It's not month to month. I mean, it's, it is month to month, but it's just one month at a time. And if you guys want to help support the gym, keep this program running, keep the gym running, um, it would mean a lot to us. We would love it. Uh, we want to be here forever. And so if you're willing and able, it would be very much appreciated. With that in mind, let's get back to action, guys. It is time to work. Here we go. Um, let's set up a heavy live pace. See, three heavy punches, quick double jab. Bang, 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 ba ba. So, heavy three punches, quick double jab. Ready, go, go, go. Ba ba ba. Ba ba ba. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You can start it with a kick, you can end it with a kick. Completely up to you, get it. But I wanna see a heavy three and a double jab out. So start with a kick or end with a kick. But in the middle of that, I wanna see heavy three, double jab. Bang, 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 pop up. Good, good, good. Start that attack with a kick or end that attack with a kick. Get it, get it, get it. Time. Go ahead and get into the black box, guys. Actually, let's share one black box. This is the same size as most living rooms. You can even cut this in half to even be smaller. Completely fine. But from um, one end to the other, you're just going to sprint down, sprint back, sprint down, sprint back. Ready, set, go. Sprints inside the box. Sprints inside the box. It's a sprint. But make sure you guys touch the ground with your hands. Touch the ground with your hands. Get it, sprint, 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 sprint.
Let's see a duck hop down and back. Duck hop, duck hop. So you're gonna pop a squat and just gonna hop, hop, hop. Yep, low as you can. Hop, 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 hop. The lower the better, the lower the better. Let's see a duck walk now. Duck walk down and back. And let's see a forward bear crawl down and back. Hit it. Crawl, crawl, crawl. Hit the ground, mountain climbers. 10 seconds fast as you can. Go, go, go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five. Get those knees up to the chest. Big mountain climbers. Four. Three. Two. One. Time. Go ahead and let's get a heavy three shots. Hit a sprawl. Hit the ground fast. Get up fast. Bang, 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 sprawl. Bang, 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 sprawl. Doosh. Hit like you're trying to hurt somebody. Hit like you're trying to hurt somebody. Bang, 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 hit a sprawl. Bang, 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 hit a sprawl. From the plank position, let's see plank to push-ups non-stop. Every time I say go, you're gonna bear crawl to the end of the black box and then you can go right back to the plank to push-ups. When I say go, bear crawl to the end of the box or the end of your living room space and give me plank to push-ups. Ready, and go. Crawl, 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 crawl. And then once you get to the end of your training space, whether it is a mat, a backyard, a lawn, or your living room, or bedroom, or your kids' room, whatever it may be, go right back to the plank to push-ups. Every time I say go, you're gonna bear crawl back to the end of your space, and then go back to the plank to push-ups. Go! Having a good workout, Brittany? Mm -hmm. The best. Every time I say go, you're going to sprint to the other side and go back to the side shuffles and touching. Go! Boom. And then back to the side shuffles. Touch each side, touch. Touch each side, touch. Touch each side, touch. Go! 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 Go. 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 Time, last addition as far as this part goes. Heavy three, hit a sprawl, fire a kick, 
post out, fire another kick. Final addition. Three, sprawl, kick, post out, fire another kick. Post out is just taking your jab hand and just posting out, just stiff arm, boom, and then firing another kick right after it. Just like what they are doing right in front of your eyes. Boom. Ten seconds. Finish it, finish it, finish it. Time hit the ground. Bicycles, go, go, go. Leg lifts. Toe touches. Chair pickers. Yeah. Yeah, there's a bunch of names. Name two other names. Go. Uh, seated V twist. Well, seated twist. Okay, okay. And what's another one? Oh, no. Oh. Side to side. Side to side. That's a good one. You have left Yuma speechless. Bicycles. Leg lifts. Crunches. Toe touches. Crunches. Toe touches. Bicycles. Leg lifts. Bicycles. Last minute, guys, last minute. Crunches. Toe touches. V ups. Bicycles, chair pickers, or Russian twists, or side to side as per Miss Brittany Cloudy. Russian twist. Twist, uh, Russian twist. Bicycles, leg lifts. 15 seconds, guys. V ups. 10 seconds. Bicycles. V ups, bicycles, get it, get it, get it, get it. V ups, last five seconds, go. Five, four, three, two, one, time. Coach Brittany, did you have fun today? Oh, lots of fun. Yeah, what about you, Ma? You have a good time? Oh, yes, he gave us a thumbs up. That means it was a really, really good time. Guys, that concludes our class for today. The focus today was utilizing kicks. Instead of just always ending with the kicks, you could always start with the kicks, or you could always have kicks in the midst of your attack too as well. With that said, we appreciate all the support you guys have given us. If you guys want to continue to give your support, there's a link in the bio um, right below if you want to click on it, uh, straight to our PayPal link. If you guys want to um, sign up for this online membership to keep these online classes going and also to support the gym, it's 50 bucks for the month of April and then we will just uh, make it for the month of April uh, because we don't know when we're going to open again. We could be opening any month now. And so it's uh, just one month at a time. Your support goes a long way and means a lot. Love you guys, and we will see you guys soon. Shh.